You've probably seen that message pop up when starting the game. You know the one, processing Vulcan shaders. And sometimes it just sits there for ages. I didn't know what it meant either, so I went away and learned about it. And here's the simple version. Shaders are specialized programs. They tell your graphics card how things should look. Things like shapes, colors, lighting, shadows, reflections, all of that. Modern games use thousands of them, but they're not in a format your graphics card can use straight away. So the game has to process them first. Now, when you see that loading screen, there's usually a cancel button. And I know how tempting it is to hit it. So what happens if you do? Well, the game will still run, but any shaders that weren't finished have to be compiled whilst you're playing the game. That means the first time you see a new effect, like an explosion or a shadow, your game might stutter or even freeze for a moment. Now, on some powerful systems, you probably won't even notice, especially if your GPU and drivers handle it well. On others, you'll get random hiccups until everything is processed in the background. So it's not dangerous to cancel, but you're basically moving the weight from the loading screen into your gameplay. Now, Vulkan itself is part of the reason this happens. It's a graphic system that gives developers more control and better efficiency. But the trade-off is that the shaders need to be compiled into a special format before your graphics card can actually use them. And that can take a while. And here are the three main reasons why. Number one is volume. A modern game can have tens of thousands of shaders and every single one has to be processed. Number two is optimization. It's not only translation. The shaders are tuned so they run better on your hardware. And number three is caching. Once they're processed, they're stored for later. The first run is slow, but it should get quicker next time. Things that make it slow down again when you launch a game later on could be an update or a change in drivers. That resets the cache. If shaders are compiled on the fly every time, your game would freeze the moment something new appeared. So watching the percentage go up at the start might feel a little bit annoying, but it's actually saving you frustration later. So next time you see processing Vulcan shaders, that's what's going on in the background. Your PC is doing the prep work to make sure the game runs smooth once you're in. If that's helped you, let me know in the comments down below, or just drop in an emoji for the sake of engagement. Thank you so much for watching. You guys take care, and I'll see you in the next one.